Ah, uh, yes, the great outdoors. Viewers, we're back. It's Thursday, April 11th. Why don't we just jump right into this? Here's some highlights from last Thursday's birthday party for 26 year old Kyle Strait. Oh. <laughs> Mm, I love Charlie. <laughs> hey. Hey, we oh como se dice. Help me. Mucho borracho. As of right now, we got two lovebirds trying to tunk us at the we're at the river. We stopped at the river. And then somebody thought they were cooler than they were and went down in the bottom. Wow, what well, fighting, icing, murdering in the other hand. And I'll be completely honest, I'm battling a bout of post-party depression. That's why I'm here in this beautiful location, trying to reset. Because the only thing that can cure PPD is another party. And next Thursday, we have Sea Otter Classic. Excited about that. But what really kicked off my episode of PPD was Monday's news, when I had to talk about USAC enforcing UCI's stupid rule. The good news, the UCI has decided to back down from enforcing this rule, but are gathering their brains for how to enforce it for 2014. Cameron Zink had a successful procedure done on his leg to address his compartment syndrome. After I spoke to him, I realized he's doing fine. He's hobbling around on one crutch rather than two, and he, in the back of his head, he thinks he can ride a sea otter, although he'll just be spinning. And then finally, Are you between the ages of 14 and 19 and think you're the next freeride mountain bike legend? Well, Red Bull has a contest for you. All you got to do is submit a 60 second video to RedBullPhenom.com. Well, first you upload, upload to YouTube with keyword Red Bull Phenom. Just go to RedBullPhenom.com for more information. That's pretty much going to wrap up the news for now. I think we're going to have to move set before the police come. For the Climb Magazine, I'm Grizz. We'll catch you Monday.